you should trust your preparation right. and trust that the Holy Spirit has filled that. But there's also a willingness to be led and steered and to really to be, you must be attentive also while you're speaking. Yeah. And, but that skill, that skill gets honed not so much just on stage, not just on stage. Yes, you practice mm-hmm. discerning and, and did I hear the Spirit right? And when I made this decision, you know, was, was that the Holy Spirit? Um, and you kind of learn how to, how to, to kind of, tr- how to learn that voice. Yeah. But that comes through your, your kind of private experience, yeah, your, man. your, your personal experience of God outside. And I'm not, I'm not, I'm not talking about preparation. I'm talking about away from preparation. Right. I'm talking about your personal daily yeah. prayer life. Yeah. And that you, begin to recognize how the Holy Spirit speaks to you. Yeah. What it even feels like. Yeah. That that sense of 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 being something is brought to your mind. Yeah. And, and you begin to learn uh that skill. And but that's honed in your the secret of your 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 prayer room. Yeah. Man. In the quiet place. Whereas you and the Father and the door is shut. Yeah. And the scriptures are open and you're in conversation with God. 